Elijah, thanks for joining us. That was your first league start for the Rangers. How good was it to be out there for the whole 90 minutes? Yeah, it felt really good, you know, like um, it's been a lot of hard work in the making. So, you know, I've just been eager to just get the opportunity and show what I can do for the team. And uh, I felt like I played my part today and um, we, overall we had a really good result. So, you know, hopefully more to come for me and the team. The gaffer mentioned you by name afterwards and said he was really impressed with your performance. What do you feel you did well today? Um, I think firstly, I just gave, you know, a lot of energy, you know, in and out of possession. And I felt like I showed my quality when I can get on the ball and, make, and try and make things happen and stuff like that. You know, I was unlucky to not, you know, get the get the ball in the back of the net at the end when the goalies, you know, made a good save. So, you know, I just feel like, you know, I feel like my game's in a good place and I feel like I can really, you know, help this team going forward. So, let's see. You haven't had many opportunities. Are you hoping that you've done enough under a new coach that we're going to see you a little bit more regularly? I hope so. Like, I'm, I'm putting in all the work I can, you know. I feel like I've been... You know, there's been times where I feel like I could have got the nod and I haven't, but, you know, that's part of football and um, it's only made me better. It's just more practice and, you know, more hard work to go. So hopefully, you know, I'm, I really like the new gaffer, you know, we're getting on really well and um, you can see that the boys are liking it, the, the style of play. You saw a glimpse of it today, so hopefully I've done enough and, um, yeah, we'll see going forward. You talk about the style of play. What's it like for the players to have such a big switch round in such a short time? Um... That's part of being a footballer, you've got to be able to adapt, so you like the style of play, you know, it actually does suit a lot of the players in the team, you know, getting the ball down and wanting to play and stuff like that, but then still out of possession having that, you know, that grit and desire to, you know, still do the, the hard parts of the game. So we've we've adapted really well, you know, today was going great and then we've just conceded on, on a set piece, which is obviously painful, but, you know, I feel like this is um, the start of positive things to come for sure. Rotherham never make it easy. What was it like battling out there with the weather as well? You know what, full credit to them. They've got their style of, that of what they do and, you know, they, they're good at it. Um, but, you know, I would say credit to the, um, to the back line, especially they, they took a lot of um, pressure, but they dealt with it really, really well. And I felt just together as a team today, we just felt together. We felt together. We all worked for each other. You know, there was parts of the game that you, you don't necessarily want to do, but you have to do for the team. And I felt like everyone you know, can come away from this game saying they've done what they needed to do. So, you know, we dealt with it really well. You've just come from the dressing room. Are the players up because they've managed to get a good away point or a little bit low not to have got all three? We're low. We're low. Like, yeah, the performance was better, you know, and stuff like that. It's not a loss, but we're not, we're not aiming to be a team that, you know, are happy with draws or to be happy with the situation we're in. Nowhere near, so... We've got high aspirations for this season and, you know, that's a great performance and we're going to build on it, but the result, we're not going to be happy with that. So three points is what's the most important to us and we didn't get that today. So we need to get straight back to the training pitch on Monday and put things right. So we'll be looking for the three points next week for sure.